Hi there, welcome back to this channel, Sir Matigo. I'm here again to explain to you multiplying polynomials, binomial by binomial, the FOIL method. I want to show you how the FOIL method is used in multiplying polynomials and uh, I am showing here two examples. Example 1x plus 3 quantity times x plus 8 quantity. Below is uh, what FOIL stands for. This is how it is done. Let me start multiplying. I'll start with the first terms x times x. Write it at the right side. And the answer is x squared. That's our f. Next is x times 8, the outer terms. Write it at the right side. And the answer is positive 8x. Then 3 times x, the inner terms, the answer is 3x. And the last one is 3 times 8, the last terms, the answer is positive 24. Looking at the expression below, there are two terms that are similar and uh, I have to combine these two terms. And the answer is positive 11x. The final answer now is x squared plus 11x plus 24. I'll move to the next example dealing with positive and negative sign of the numbers. We have x negative 3 quantity times x positive 8 quantity. Using the FOIL method, we have x times x is x squared. Next is that's our f next is x times positive 8 is positive 8x that's our o next is negative 3 times x is negative 3x that's our i and the last one is negative 3 times positive 8 is equal to negative 24 that's our l in the expression below, there are two terms that are similar and we have to combine them. So our final answer is x squared positive 5x negative 24. Using this FOIL method, we apply the distributive property of multiplication over addition. That is why every time we proceed to the next term, we always use plus. This method is very easy to memorize. I have here examples that you need to answer if you have time and then compare your answer with my answer. That's all folks, thank you. Congratulations you have learned again today. Thank you for watching, please subscribe to see my future videos.